You know, for myself and my family, you know, we've had to move around a little bit. That's kind of the nature of the business I'm in. Of course, I hope that stops now. I had about my wife told me, she says, you move again, you're moving without me. So I said, all right, we've got to find a way to win a few games and stay alive. But, you know, so, but we've moved. And when you move around, I've got three kids, and we're a real close-knit family. And our Catholic faith has been a constant in our life. And wherever you go, whether it's Gainesville, Florida, or South Bend, Indiana, or Syracuse, New York, and Bloomington, Indiana, places like I said to myself, I'd never be. But wherever you go, you find that sense of community in the Catholic Church. And that's been real strong for our family, for my wife, my kids, and for myself. And I would tell you that that's one of those great things about having your Catholic faith, that it will be there for you. And it, and it will wherever you go, wherever it takes you. You can find a sense of community, and that's important. You know, one of the things that kind of drives me a little crazy is I'm kind of one of those guys, like, you know, I believe in sticking together. And so sometimes, because I feel so strong about that sense of community in the Catholic Church, and you know, like, like you, like I got friends and different people, and I always always amazes me how people pick and choose when their faith is strong and their faith in the Catholic Church. And I always equate it, I'm like, you know, in a family or in a marriage, everybody's not always perfect. But when it's not so perfect, you don't say, like, today I'll be married, but next week I don't know. You know? Or when you're kids, you love your kids, and, you know, and, but sometimes kids are kids and they make mistakes. You don't not love your kids anymore. But sometimes it amazes me with people with, I've been around in my, in my life, it's like, you know, well, you know, this, this went wrong with the Catholic Church. Ah, I got to go find something else over here. As opposed to that ability to say, you know, I believe and I'm with you in the good times and the bad times. And my faith is strong and my beliefs are strong. Nothing's ever perfect, you know. But you don't have to run off and find something else just because this little piece here you, don't, you might not see in the same light. It doesn't mean you have to run away and find another faith. Because really, it's no different than your family, and it's no different than your marriage. It's no different than a lot of things. You've got to have the ability to stick with it and to be there in good times and, and in bad. And I'm not here to preach to you. I'm just here to tell you that sometimes I think that in our world today, in the effort that everyone wants such instant gratification and change, and that's not good anymore, I'm over here, bam. And I don't know how productive that is. Because I think that starts to spill in other parts of your life. 